Baby. Baby. Mm. Mm, oh my god. Baby. The movie's over. The the movie's over. <laughs> well, yeah, I mean, maybe the last 30 minutes or so. I mean, I can tell you all about it once you wake up. How about fun? It's time to get up. Well, of course I didn't tell you about. <laughs> I didn't want to wake you up. You seem so tired. You're doing all that yawning. Look at you right now. You're yawning. Now, don't try to deny it. You are plum tuckered out. And there's nothing wrong with it. People get tired. It's fun. Mm-hmm. So why don't you just boot scoop boogie and um, we can pick this up another time. Uh, well, it's not super late, but if we keep chit-chatting, then, uh, then it's going to get super late. Oh, well, I did have an, another idea that we could... um potentially consider well how about if you weren't gonna go home tonight hmm well <laughs> I have a shower here mm-hmm and I have some basic toiletries you can use my body wash and shampoo and I mean it won't be the first time you've worn the same clothes two days in a row. Come on, you don't have anything to do tomorrow. And we've never, you know, been in the same location when we woke up in the morning and gotten breakfast. And, well, that's not fair. If you make that a rule in order for me to be able to spend the night with you, that's never going to happen. I'm sorry I say breakfast, okay? I also can't say cannibal very well. Can't, cannibal, 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 cannibal. <laughs> I default, I have a speech impediment. Don't pick on me, you're so mean. Mm. I mean it though. I've got that California king size bed and it's awful big and lonely. Well, yes, I do have my doggy, but like he's not that big. And plus, with the California King, even with him in the bed, there's plenty of room for you. So, how about it? Hmm? Go on, I promise nothing will happen that you don't want to happen. Well, I guess you're right that it would be more you concerned about something happening with me that I wouldn't want to happen. But let me tell you, there's absolutely nothing. That could happen between us that I wouldn't want to happen or been dreaming about happening or is currently happening in my mind. What? Baby. <laughs> I have plenty of pillows. You know I'm addicted to them. I have like one, two, three, four of those gigantic, really squishy that like pop right back into place body pillows on my bed right now. And then I have a couple of other kind of crappy body pillows, but I use them to, to push up the other ones. Mm -hmm. And then I've got plenty of blank. I forget you, you're not really into plenty of blankets, are you? <laughs> well, I have them for me. And you know how I have that, um, that ability to suck. Oh, no, I do that too. Um, but I have that ability to just absolutely pull all the heat out of the air at all times so I can keep you nice and cool. You love it when I'm snuggling on your chest and you begin to actually feel kind of, you know, cold. For some reason you like that. I absolutely hate it, but you make me feel so nice and snuggly and warm. Plus then we can see exactly what my fingers do all over you perhaps it's just listen here call it the call of the wild but you know what they say about us hellhounds oh well we're always after a good bone you know morning noon and night and i do hear mornings are almost pretty much guaranteed time to catch one what <laughs> 
baby, come on. Come on, you're tired. What do you mean, what will your neighbors say? Did they even notice you leaving and what you were wearing? Oh, they did. Well, I don't care what my neighbors say. I don't care what they think. I don't care what they do. All I care about is hmm, being able to be near my sweet baby. Being able to show you the love that you deserve. And waking up to your eyes looking into mine. And um, figuring out how many variations of I can of your name that I can say pretty breathlessly. Now, come on. Don't be so obtuse. (laughs) Why don't you just, uh, here we go. Yeah, see, get up. And no, put them car keys back down. You are a stubborn one, aren't you? Oh, come on. Here, look. I tell you what. If you... Feel any more awake in the next hour, then go ahead and skedaddle on home. But I will say that I'll be highly disappointed as I didn't get my kisses. Mm, I didn't get my snuggles. And I damn sure didn't get the cuddles that I was promised. Hmm? (laughs) All right, all right, all right. I tell you what. How about I find another way to tire you out to where you absolutely won't be able to deny me? I don't know. I was just thinking a little bit of dancing. Oh, what do you mean you don't like dancing? I know there's one type of dancing you can't resist. Mattress dancing. (laughs) Oh, goodness gracious. Look at you blush. It's absolutely so cute and adorable. Baby, come on now. I want to be the reason you have the sweetest dreams tonight. And I want to wake up realizing that my dream wasn't a dream, it's reality. Plus, if we're going to move this relationship forward, this is something we should get used to, you know? Sleeping in the same bed, waking up in the same den together, your bedroom. I'm sorry. Are my people call them dens? Come on now, don't don't tell me no. You look in these cute puppet dog eyes and tell me you can say no. <laughs> let's uh let's go on back. Well, don't tell me you're too tired for any of that. I promise you, give me about ten seconds and I can get you nice and there we go, awake. Well, I said give me 10 seconds. I didn't say when it started. Now, um, now that I've got your, um, well, I've got something in my hands, but now that I definitely got your attention, maybe I can um, <laughs> get a couple more things filled, you know? I have some deep, deep cavernous um, sections of body that could definitely use some exploring, you know? Maybe I can get you Lewis and Clark and down some canals. No? Oh, exactly. There we go. I thought I would be able to convince you this way. I just had to get you um up and at them. <laughs> okay, come on. Let's go. Let's go, baby. What? what? Oh, um... Well, I mean, I, I don't have any on me here. Uh, my name's not exactly P. Diddy. I don't keep thousands of bottles around. But um, let's see what we, you know what? You, you know what? Let's see what we can do. Maybe if I do some huck tua, we can make it work. Hmm? Oh, I think we can. I think we can. I'm quite, um, I'm quite uh, adventurous, if you know what I mean. Mm-hmm. Resourceful. Oh, we can make a couple of different things work. <laughs> hey guys, Zena Alexander here. Oh my goodness. Um, so I do have a California king size bed. I like big beds. I'm small. I'm only about five foot with shoes on, but I love big beds. And um, something that with every uh, relationship I've had is I've always 
tried to get my boyfriends to stay over the over not, but um, my my friends all kind of have this running joke that I'm the uh, Uber girl. I will always end up in an Uber heading home at some point pretty quickly. Um, <laughs> I don't know what that means about me, but it is a thin. Um, so yeah, this is inspiration is more how I would like things to have gone in the past versus what they actually did. Um, usually we would, uh, end up watching TV. Someone would end up getting sleepy and then maybe, maybe a little bit of messing around, but nothing going, unfortunately too far, despite I would want. And then going home, I think that's the YouTube friendly version. Um, and then, and, and then, then going home, uh, or, the, or them going home. I, I usually was me going home. I think one time it was actually, uh, we, we were at my place. Why didn't I ever like have more of my exes at my place? Anyways, sorry, this is not therapy. Uh, this is just the inspiration for this audio. I want to say thank you to all of you guys. I am back to doing damn near daily content. I know I keep saying that, um, because I keep having stuff happen in real life that causes breaks. It's a natural thing. It's perfectly fine. Um, but I do, I do still love doing daily content and, uh, sharing pieces of my life. So I get really excited for tomorrow's update and monster girl manor is absolutely coming back. Lacey's working on an update. Um, I know star is going to be making her debut with her VTuber model soon, and I'm going to be doing more little confessional shorts, uh, giving kind of some behind the scenes ideas of what's going on. And I, uh, have actually have my TikTok going now, which has been fun. Um, so I should have some more TikToks coming out. Um, if you guys have not followed over there, I haven't talked about it. So, uh, I wouldn't expect you to know it. Anyways, I love you guys. I'll see you in the next video. Bye.